Hello, hello, and welcome back to another Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 playthrough video. Today, next up in our list of beginner parks, we have Dynamite Dunes, where the objective is to have 650 guests in the park by the end of year 3, with a park rating of 600. Now, we are in the middle of a desert. This theme park contains just one roller coaster, but has space for expansion. That makes me wonder, can I buy land? <laughs> no, I don't. Have... Oh, no, I do. I have land over here I could buy. And we have three years, so... That, I might buy that, I don't know. But as as you guys were uh, let me know in the previous video, uh, I can charge for rides and for the park entrance, but if, you, if guests pay for one, they're less willing to pay for the other. So if this is anything like Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, I think I'm going to leave this at zero and maximize the earning potential from rides because I think with rides, you have the potential to earn more versus at the gate. To start, Let's initiate our park with the soul of Roller Coaster Tycoon right at the entrance, which is convenient because if it ever gets too noisy, we can just move over, move away. <laughs> I don't want to listen to it forever. Ah, I'm just kidding. I love it. I'd never want to stop listening to it. Let's let this fire up and go yellow. Ooh, I want to try this goldish, yellowish. Never mind. That's disappointing. <laughs> I thought I was going to get the, the rails to be that color. Sad. Not that one. Not that one, but it's good. Not that one either. Yes! Yes, yes, yes. Let the park be initiated! Ho ho ho! I think one of you in the comments even talked about it, where you initiate your parks with the merry-go-round music. <laughs> this, this one in particular. Uh-oh, I forgot the exit. Let me put that down. Plop. Do I get dynamite scenery? Oh man. I was hoping I did, because this is Dynamite Dunes after all. Uh, so that's our merry-go-round. We only have one thrill ride, and it's hardly even, doesn't even count as a thrill ride. This pathetic thing. <laughs> Let's put it right over here, and mess up one of our palm trees, unfortunately. Let's see, since we're charging per ride, I think I can get away with prices similar to Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. Let's see if they'll pay $3 for this. I'm not gonna touch the price in the merry-go-round because it's so bad that even in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, they stop, they stop paying the default price after a certain point. <laughs> so I'm gonna leave that. Anybody? Somebody, please? Oh, we gotta take her. I guess $3 isn't too much. Well, that's all the flat rides with the exception of these, but I don't feel like building those. Oh, we have a log flume. Well, let's do that right away. This is a hot part. Actually, no, 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 I forgot. We need food and drinks because i always forget to do that let's get some burgers right here i feel sorry for the employees they have to listen to the twist ride and drinks uh i don't want to mess up my palm tree we'll put it right here make that a buck 70 i don't know and ice cream because we're on the hot desert let's see how do i want to lay the path out so the path comes over here I think I'm going to have the path come out, loop back here, go over this dune, maybe have a field flat rides up here, and then come back down and connect here, and then we'll have it also go out here. So we'll have like a figure eight, kind of. I don't know. Or we could also have the path come through here, just loop around that mountain. Let's paint our ice cream stand. This is something I actually looked back at my, I think it was Fungus Woods, where I discovered this, where I was freaking out that, oh, look, you can paint the ice cream cone, but it doesn't do anything. It does do something. Watch, watch the stall. I had no idea it was changing color when I painted it. <laughs> so, we have. <laughs> it works. It does work. And last of all, we need a bathroom. Where should I put it? Um, we'll put it right over here. Pop. And we will charge forty cents. <laughs> I hope you have. I hope you all have changed. If you don't have change, you don't get to pee. <laughs> All right. Well, this park is nearly three times the size of, well, just over twice as twice the size as Forest Frontier. Not not geographically. I mean, the number of guests required to win to win the number of guests required to win is about twice as many, a little over twice as many. What am I saying? We need a lot of guests in the park, and the soft cap of guests you can attract is determined by the number of rides you have in the park. So, 
Yeah, we're gonna have to be really dense when we build this. I don't I don't mean dense in the head, I mean build dense. <laughs> dense in the head. Splish splash. This will be like a terrain log flume. I always like water rides that like go under themselves like this. And do we have an interest rate? No, it doesn't say what it is. We do have interest, though. It just doesn't say what our interest rate is. That's annoying. But I can't... I can't play with my loan forever, it seems. Okay, let's have a second hill. Back up to 50 feet. Drop to 35. Can I do that? Ah, oh, dang it. The the the, the 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 dune is in the way. Now I'm doing the exact same thing. <laughs> what am I doing? All right, let's bring this back to our station. Um, not like that. The 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 station has to go here, and this will not fit there. I can't do that, though. <laughs> that, that's cursed. <laughs> Good luck on this ride. <laughs> Getting your boat capsized. What is the ground level? Hold on. Are we in negative five again? Uh, yeah, everything's negative five again. That's weird. Why is everything negative five? This place is going to get flooded. All right. To five feet. Oh, shoot. Can't do that. Uh, let's bring this to 10 feet. And give ourselves enough room to... There we go. Perfect. And we'll have to decorate this with some kind of scenery, although it looks like we're rather limited in our scenery options. I wonder if there's additional scenery we might unlock. Oh yeah, uh, scenery and theming is one of the, th the things we can unlock, so let's, let's unlock that. Give me all the boots. Oh, we only get 30. That's lame. I'm going to turn this down. And fire away! Alright. Log flumes are pretty OP in terms of money, so this will be a big helper for us. Problem is, we only have 180-something guests, so let me... What the heck? Okay, let's do this. Why am I doing this? The, the, let me do this the smart way. <laughs> What's wrong with me? All right. Well, that's testing. Let's see. Do we have anything else to do? Oh, we have a wood, wood roller coaster. Nice. All right. Where do I build this? I have no idea where to build this. Because <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to cut myself off. We need all this flat space for flat rides. We'll hopefully eventually unlock. So I want to build the wooden roller coaster over the dunes, but to do that I have to build the pathway out, and paths cost money. Eh, let's just lay the park out, why not? Let's, uh, sneak this back here. Sneak around the cactus, because I don't want to mess it up. Nice. This is wasted space, but I'm trying to look, I'm trying to look organic here. Boom! So that's one loop. You never want a lot of you don't want a lot of dead ends in your park cuz guests have a horrible time finding their way around. So loops are always helpful. Uh da da. Then we'll loop around behind the log flume. Oh, we have Roman theming. That's fun. I'm not sure what I would do with that here though. Oops. Okay, what am I... Aha! No! That is not what I wanted to do. Here we go. Okay, that's another loop completed. And man, we are taking a big shark bite out of our money. Hold on, I never, I never changed the price of this. Let me see. 
This is $3, and we're making about 3000 per hour. Will people pay more for this if I turn it up? Dynamite Blaster. Three trains, five cars per train. Okay. Yeah, people are getting a line, so I guess I can charge more. <laughs> we just doubled the profit of this ride just by turning this up. I might be able to turn it up more. What are the stats on this? Oh, not bad. I wonder if I can go all the way up to $8. Someone in the comments told me that the price is determined by the excitement rating rounded to the nearest whole number. In my experience, it's usually the excitement rating plus the intensity rating, but that's just a ballpark number because excitement is a bigger factor than intensity. Uh, that's just my usual shortcut as I add the two together. So this ride, based on the way I normally do it, could potentially charge $15. Also because nausea surprisingly affects the price. But I could be doing it completely wrong. That's just my experience. But hey, look, they're still paying. Let's try $10. <laughs> they're, they're all paying it. Woohoo! I'm curious. Let's go all the way up to 15 Yeah, that's way too much. They're all like, never mind. We're not paying that. <laughs> Okay, but they're paying 12-ish. 12, 12 I'm just going to leave it at 12. Okay. What are the stats in this since I forgot about it? Oh, good. Lovely. And now let's change this to 350 as we always do. Same price throughout park. And this can be... I think we can charge 12 for this. For some reason, people are willing to pay a lot for log flumes. Even though the stats are... They're good, but not that good. Oh, they're going in. Nice. I think we'll just leave that at 12 for now and we'll always have to check back on this to see if anything has zero people on it just to make sure no one is a uh, make sure all the rides are actually being ridden okay let's sneak behind the cactuses I'm going to take pity on my poor guest's legs instead of making them go down and then up again. <laughs> but they'll have to do it on this dune. Down we go. To ground level. Ouch. Look at my... Look at my balance. It's taking its toll on me. Okay. And we have a little bit of space for some more flat rides. Speaking of flat rides, what if we... Okay, we unlocked classical theming. Okay, those are the only notifications I have so far. Something I forgot to do is hire staff. So let's hire one mechanic, a handful of these guys, and let's get some benches and garbage cans in place so people can rest their weary legs. Okay, we only have one kind of garbage can. That's annoying. Oh, I forgot this spot. Hold on. Ta-da! And now, for the trash cans. Alright, so we made 3,000 last month. Or no, what am I saying? We lost 3,000 from landscaping, apparently. Landscaping? What did I do with landscaping? That's confusing. Maybe building paths counts as landscaping. Uh, but we made 1,500 uh, in ride tickets. And we are not even a third of the way through May, and we already have nearly a thousand, so that's a good sign. We are attracting people to the park, and everything is being ridden, as far as I can see. What are we researching? Classic mini roller coaster. Okay. Oh, we just got it. Look at that. Uh huh. Let's build one of these. Maybe dance around this small little dune. This might be tricky, but I'm going to try it. Let's see, how many trains do we get? That's one train. Two trains, lovely. And I can't do that. Okay. Can you imagine going up a, a zigzag lift hill like this? Steep drop! Woo! 
and a steep slope to level piece. Man, I wonder what kind of g-forces that's gonna pull. <laughs> I'm just doing this just to experiment here. Uh, nice. Oh, that doesn't even look too bad. I might be able to squeeze out some pretty nice stats out of this little roller coaster with crazy movements like that. I wonder if we can go from 50 to 45. I'm guessing probably not, but I want to try it. Actually, no, 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 no. Let's to do that. Let's slip to level. Here we go. That might be easier. Woo! Oh! <laughs> now, isn't that fun? Let's have a really rough uh, hill segment here, just for funsies. And it looks like I can't do that. I can't do that either. What's in the way? Oh, the dune's in the way. Okay. Um, okay. I do need to come back to the station, so I wonder if I... No, not like that. Here we go. I do not have enough room to do that. I wonder if instead, if I do this, not there, uh, this, oh, uh -huh. here we go, here we go, oh wait, no, I do have room, let's go down one first, oh dang it, there we go. Now I can put brakes there, it's a little bit safer. And, uh, fix my path here. Slow up to level. I'll put some brakes here too, just as a preliminary slowdown in case these brakes fail or something. Um, slow this to... 18-ish. And this one to 13. <laughs> la 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 la. Look at these derpy trains. Ladybird trains. What are the default colors? Purple and or aha, red. Cool. Anyway, let's let that test and connect our paths up here. And I have a wasted space here that I must fill with a palm tree. Okay. Let's watch these, watch these G2. Oh my goodness. <laughs> these are rough. <laughs> I wonder what kind of stats we're going to produce with this thing. Oh, that's not so bad. I don't think we'll have any collisions there. Oh, wait, wait. Does this right have photo sections? I forgot. Hold on, hold on. Well, first, what stats? Oh! That's a really high intensity relative to the excitement. That's annoying. Uh, okay. Do I get... Oh, yeah, that's right. No photo section. Darn it. Okay, fine. Well, this will be a medium ride, I guess. But we already know the stats. Let's open it. And uh, let's try 10. Well, people pay 10. I mean, it was 4 plus 6, roughly. Rounding down, at least. That person turned away. Is that because it's not... They don't have... I noticed that even if you open the ride, they won't get in line unless there are test results. Maybe the, the the guests know that it may not be safe. I know it's safe because I already tested it. I just messed this piece up right here. Looks too intense for you. What? I guess it does look kind of intense. Oh, but someone's getting in line. That's good. Yeah, it's, it is almost 7. Actually, that's 4.7 plus 6 plus 7. I wonder if I can charge more for this. Maybe 12? Will people pay 12? Come on, come on, come on, people! Come on down and enjoy the uh, your uh, spine-bending uh, mega G-forces. <laughs> oh, these guys know what's up. They're sitting in the back. Respect. Okay, let's see if these guys pay or if they turn around. Oh, we have an information kiosk. 
Okay, they're paying. That's good. So let's build that new kiosk. And uh, sorry, tree. It had to be like that. Same price throughout park, and set this to twenty dollars as always, and we'll double the price of the of the uh, park maps. I still want trees. Let's plant some more trees since I messed those ones up. There we go, much better. Maybe I can improve the excitement on this ride with some scenery. So let's plant some palm trees around this. and name this something relevant to the scenery. Coconutter. <laughs> I don't even know if I spelled coconut right. It's not even a real, coconutter isn't a real word, but the, the, it cover the T and the E, the R, coconut. I don't know. Oh, yay. I'm going to butcher this. I think it's called D.A. Regiment Skinder. Uh, <laughs> somebody speaks. I don't know, is that, is that, uh, Austrian or Russian? I don't know. Someone correct me, because I probably just botched the name of that song. But I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> Let's get some variety with some tall palm trees. This guy is taking pictures. Thanks. Makes me feel special. Now let's see if we had an effect on the stats. Oh, we had a little bit of an effect. We're up to 4.8 now. We have a steady, modest income, it appears. We doubled our income from April, more than doubled it, actually. And we're a little more than halfway through June, and we have 2,000, so... I'm gonna guess this is gonna go up to 4,000 by the end of the month, now that we have a new ride. Speaking of rides, let's check to make sure... Okay, if people are still riding everything, that's good. But, uh... We still don't have a lot to work with. Oh, we're getting a new gentle ride. That's fun. Let's build out the rest of our gentle rides. Or our flat rides, just because we can. And... Nice stats. I wonder how much I can charge for this. Let's try $4. Will people pay $4 to be scared? <laughs> he doesn't. Let's see. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Too expensive. Okay, $3. How about that? Any takers? Okay, the red shirt turned away. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Okay, fine. We'll do $2. I don't even remember what the default was. I think it was $2. Okay, it looks like we're stuck at $2 for this one. And we'll build a custom one of these. I'm pretty sure this ride is one of the rides where the length of the station does not determine the number of cars you get, but the length of the ride itself. So... But I don't expect a lot of people are going to ride it. These never get a lot of attention, so... sneak out through here. I can, but does, do I need to, though? I can't see what I'm doing. Okay, this is fun. It's a little messy. <laughs> we got a spaghetti a spaghetti ride. <laughs> and I didn't have the sense to build it away from the... What was I thinking? <laughs> There's no room for the queue line. <laughs> I'll have to move stuff around if I want a queue line. Can I sneak this over here? No. Ah, well. I don't expect this to have a lot of demand for riders. Any uh, anyway. It's, uh, it's scenic. That's all it is. Ooh. I get sports cars, race cars. Yeah, I don't expect a lot of people are going to want to ride this, so let's do sports cars, because they get a bonus. Actually, did pickup truck get a bonus? No. They're just the the dumbed-down version of race cars, because the sports cars get two riders. So pickup trucks are... Ooh, that's a cool color. Test! 
What am I rambling about? How many of these do I get? Oh, that's it. Okay, test. Actually, just open. We don't need to test it. It's not like it's going to crash. Oh, look at that. As I predicted, we exceeded 4,000 last month. Our income is going up. I like to see that. And our cute little park is growing. What are we researching? Ooh, a Ferris wheel. Nice. Now we have all of the flat rides built and the log flume. The only ride we're missing, aside from transfer rides, which don't count, the only thing we're missing is a wooden roller coaster. So let's see if we can build a full-size wooden roller coaster. Oh, seriously? Oh, no! Our loan limit is 15000 That's tiny. Uh-huh. Well, let's build a woody. And we'll build it over here. Let's see, let's get two trains on here. There we go, two trains. Not too big, but certainly not small. Eh, no, can't do that. And there's the Ferris wheel. Let's actually build that real quick, just so I can say I have all of the rides built. I wonder if I could sneak it right in here. Boom. And I don't like these colors. Let's make this red and blue. Now that's a little saturated. Maybe a light blue. And maybe this, instead of... Now let's leave that at red. Okay, I like that. That's fun. And the price. Are people going to pay that? Ah, we'll just leave it alone. They're probably not going to pay any much more than that. It's a flat, gentle ride. It really doesn't command much in the way of price. From 80 to 60, that should be just fine. I am a little concerned about this. Oh, it looks so good. Okay, I'm going to flatten this. Here we go. Look how smooth that is. I'm just a little worried about the lateral Gs. But I think we'll survive. Woo! -hoo! Geez, they're going to be glued to the side of their to the side of the train on that part. My goodness. Can we sneak under this? We cannot. Oh, we can if we do it like that. Now we're talking. This is fancy. I like this. Uh, I spoke too soon. I can't do that. Uh, no. Maybe if we go this way. Yes. Perfect. Up to 40. And let's turn right this time. Because, oh no, we're turning right here. I have a tendency, usually my rides, they all turn the same direction. So I'm just trying to fix that. But it looks like I already did. And this ride does have a photo section. I just didn't realize it because I was a fool in the previous scenario. <laughs> I didn't see it. Oh, man. If only I could go under this and then go up the hill. I wonder. If we go down like this... Okay, I'm afraid of that. Uh, maybe like this. Oh, that's fun! I can't do that, though. That's annoying. If only... <laughs> that's cool. If only I could do that. I wonder if instead... We make this more gradual and give ourselves more room... I don't think that made a difference. Yeah, that didn't change anything. What was I thinking? The difference has to be made here. Oh, it looks like we can.
Let's dive bomb the guests, give them a good scare, as we always like to do. And shoot, I can't do that. This goes all the way up back to 40. Well, I have enough speed to pull that off. I'm almost out of money. My loan is maxed out. And, oh my goodness. <laughs> Can I... Nope. Okay, I think we need to change the way we did this. Whoops. Go up here. No, we can't do that. Okay, go straight like that, we, like we did before. Aha! Here we go. Nice. Can we get a water splash up here? Oh, no, we need a photo section first. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. No photo section. We want to put a water splash here. And then... Photograph all you wet faces. <laughs> Beautiful. Now let's find out if we have enough momentum to pull that off. Let's turn up the lift hill speed to our meager 5 miles per hour. Now I'm really worried about this drop in that turn, because if that doesn't work, I'm going to have to change the whole ride. Let's see, train 1. We'll follow that as soon as it gets to the top of the lift hill. Okay. Follow on main view. Woo! There she goes! Oh, look at that. We passed two, but just barely. I think we're good. I think this ride is going to be a winner. Ah, I take that back. <laughs> I spoke too soon. Oh, no. That's a bit much. Twice. That's a bit too much on two occasions. Oh, my goodness. Let's see what that did. Oh, first of all, uh, release the camera. Oh, no! Ultra extreme! Oh, my goodness! <laughs> okay, then. We need to make some serious adjustments to this, I think. Let's get rid of this entire segment. Can we do this? Okay, from 80 to 50, I think that should be fine. And this will have to be pushed out. Oh, I am so fortunate that this ended up leveling to the same the same uh, level here. Oh, I may have just completely fixed it. Okay. Here goes nothing. Instead of following it, let's let the train progress through the track and keep the whole track in view. Woo! Look at it go! I probably should be tracking the G-Force, though. Lateral Gs look good. Nothing in red, except right there. It's just one time, though. Maybe it's okay. I'm not convinced. Okay, what's the damage? Oh, we're almost there. Okay, let's fix this one spot, and we will be good, I think. Let's go up to the level we need. And I wish we had helixes. I could helix down right here. It would be perfect. Oh, wait, no, I don't need to. I'm looking at the wrong... The water splash is a funky level. Huh. Let's have a little mini drop just to fill the space. And I think we're good. I suspect we'll be able to charge an astronomical price for our marvelous roller coaster. Oh, look at that. We're making more money. Let's turn this down. I don't like interest. Interest sucks. Not nearly as bad as it was in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, though, so that's nice. Let's see, what do we want to paint this thing? I'm thinking the traditional wood and brown color. I kind of like the different shade of the wood and the rails, though, so I'm going to leave that. And the trains, we want yellow trains with, oops, not pink, with red seats. Oh, that's colorful. I like that. All right. 
We fixed it! Woo! And look at those stats. Not bad. Okay, well, will people pay $15 for this, or is that too much? I should probably advertise this. Advertise a particular ride. Let's advertise our marvelous classic wooden roller coaster. Boom! Let's advertise the park, too. Okay, someone's in line that looks like they will pay $15. I'm going to leave that. I don't want to push it. And, oops, that's the wrong thing I wanted to push. Car ride one. Zero people on it. Not paying that much, they say. Probably because the default price was too high. And the twist? Can't afford it, and they want to go on something more thrilling, they say. Huh? You know, we really need a cash machine. Is there really no one going on the twist? That's too bad. Oh, this is a pretty little area. Look at this. Bustling activity. Oh, I love it. Is this still too expensive? Yeah, it's still too expensive. Let's try 50 cents. Come on, folks. Come on down and ride on the cars. I think we need to change this because this really needs a queue line. So I'm going to delete this and move it here. Boom, boom. And hopefully I can make this work. Okay, so... I may have to start coming up here. Oh, it looks like this isn't going to work at all. I was afraid of this. Oh, shoot. No! And now this is in the way. So I'll have to change that, too. Let's just change all of it. <laughs> Why not? Well, let's completely redesign the layout. And I'm not aligned. Darn it. I can't see what I'm doing. Oh, it's over there. <laughs> Whoops. Now it should line up. I went too high up. Let's make this wide. There we go. Now we put the entrance down. And now I can get a queue line. Boom. A tiny one. I can make it bigger. Why not? For the heck of it. All right, we have a consistent income of about 5,000. That's good to see. And that's only going to get better as the park progresses. Oh, look, people are paying for the toilets. <laughs> 40 cents. I'm curious, how much is this making? 76 per hour. That's yeah, paying itself off gradually. Let's build another one. We need a handful of these throughout the park. Let's maybe put it right there. Do we have any other food options? We do not. What are we studying? Ooh, Egyptian theming. What do you guys think? Should we theme this park to be Egyptian? I think that'd be pretty sweet. Let's let's definitely do that. Oh, we got a new ride. We have a new ride, the spiral slide. Let's put it over here. Right here. Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't think people are going to pay more than that. I'm going to leave that at the default. And maximum number of people. Oh, we have it already. Wait, what was I looking at? Oh, no, I just missed I just missed the notification. Okay. Man, this is a cool roller coaster. I'm proud of myself. My ego is immeasurably increased. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Our advertising campaign has finished. That's good. Let's start it over again. 
and advertise our log flume this time. Boop. Our log flume, which doesn't have a lot of people on it. What's going on here? Uh-oh. It looks like it just crossed the threshold into being too expensive and people aren't paying for it. And I say just crossed it because there are still people on the ride, so it crossed that threshold in the last few minutes. Now oh, people are getting in line now. That's good. Fixed it. Let's check our other rides. Oh, this is still testing. Whoops. Uh, twist one. Still no one on it. What the heck? Oh, it's too expensive, they say. Oh, yeah, of course it is. I char I'm charging $3 for it. Let's drop that to $1. What's wrong with me? I feel like a lot of flat rides are so unprofitable. They're just there to for the aesthetic. And also because of the soft guest cap. But the real money makers are stuff like this. Roller coasters. That's where the money comes from. The big dollars. I mean, this one's doing 15000 per hour. And that's at, like, mediocre capacity. There's only a handful of people riding it because there's only 500 people in the park. Speaking of which, we have almost won and we're not even done with the first year. Uh, let's see. I want to see if we can beat the scenario in the first year. Let's have a second merry-go-round right over here. Because we need to bring the music all across the park. There is no escaping the music. <laughs> yes. And it even opened with my favorite song. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, I like this color. Let's put this right there. Just for kicks, let's have these two cue lines line up perfectly. They left or right, red pill, blue pill, you get the same result. <laughs> I actually haven't seen that movie. I really need to watch it. And does this fit? Oh, it fits. Look at that! <laughs> anyway. Look at this funky action going on at the exit. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, whoops. Oh, the default price is $1, not $2. I can get away with $2, though, so I'm going to charge it. Open up for business, and let's plant some trees back here. Don't want to waste space. And one more tree right there. And what are we researching? Oh, yes! We're finally getting another thrill ride. Let's speed it up. I want it. I want it. Fourth of October. Oh, no, don't speed it up. I want to win the, I want to win the scenario first. Oh, <laughs> we're, still in, we're still in September. Don't worry about it. Yay! We win! Haha, <laughs> game over. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. I'm just kidding. Now that we have beat the scenario... Now we can go crazy and just have a good time. Let's make this park as cool as possible. First of all, let's uh, unlock the unlimited pockets of our guests with umbrellas. And make these ones pink. We have red umbrellas. Let's sell pink umbrellas. And maybe over here, yellow umbrellas. Boop. There we go. Okay, September's almost done. Let's get to October 4th and get our new thrill ride. Pirate ship! Oh, I like that one. Wonderful. Boom! Let's get this pirate ship and place it somewhere dastardly and devious. <laughs> what, what the heck am I even talking about? Dastardly devious. <laughs> okay. Right there. Oh, no. Right there. Perfect. And for this, I think we can charge about $5 initially when we open it. I think. I might be completely wrong. That's my that's my Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 estimate. It might be different than Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. And we need more staff. I completely forgot about staff. I've only had one of each walking around this whole time. This is still making a lot of money. That's good. I'm going to change the color, though. Let's change the train. Let's change the engine to be... No, I'm going to leave it where it was. What's that? What was, what was that? This color? And the cars can be brown instead. Actually, no, that blends with the track too much. Let's make these all red. Red. 
There we go. And I, I changed my mind about the engine. Let's take a yellow. Boom! More colorful. Oh, look. People are paying $5 for this. Wonderful. And our loan, we can start paying that down some more. Okay, our, it looks like we made an additional 1500 last month. Although part of that is because of shot, because it rained. Look at that. <laughs> we, what is that? We had 2500 So this is, what is that? That's uh, six times as much as we've had the previous month. Because of umbrella sales. Uh oh. Did this break down? What just happened? I'm confused, but the coconutter is back in business. That's good to see. Oh, look at these two thrill seekers sitting in the very back. Hello. No, 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 this guy. <laughs> Oh, this is actually kind of intense, watching a close-up like this. Look how pixelated it is. Oh my! <laughs> Woo! It's basically Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, riding the rides! Yeah, not really. Anyway. Xavier. Xavier. I probably said that name wrong. If anyone watching this is named Xavier, please correct me in the comments. Okay. Ooh, we're getting a new roller coaster. So we basically have everything. Um, designing by the 3rd of March. Uh, that's uh, uh, about 20-ish days away. I wonder if we can build a light rail, or miniature railway before that, just so we can say we have built everything in the game. We have all of these. We have all of these. Yeah, we built everything. Let's build a miniature railway. Just so I can say I have everything built. This will be fun. Where do I want to build it, though? Yeah, this will just be a little scenery ride. Okay, I need to see what I'm doing. Uh, turn this to plane. Oh, this doesn't need to be very big. I always try to maximize the size, as I said, but I really don't need to. I wonder if I can follow the... Oh yeah, look at that, I can. Uh-oh, can't go through there. Or there. Uh-oh, can't do that either. Here we go. Fancy that. And I know I just totally cut off this whole area, but one of the cool little things in, in uh, Open RCT2 that you can't do in the vanilla game is that. How about that? Just like in real life parks. I mean, this I can't believe this isn't part of the vanilla. Well, I guess I can believe it's not part of the vanilla game. Uh, it might have been a little too uh, advanced or complicated to program it, but... Oh, what am I doing? I only have one station. <laughs> we're, we're just building this to say we built it. Uh, yeah, whatever. We're just going to treat this like a gentle ride. So, oops. Who knows? Maybe I'll expand it later. Oh, we do get two trains, though. That's nice. But that does mean we need to turn this down. Actually, no, let's leave that up at 10 seconds. Because I imagine this ride duration is going to be about... Eh, never mind. <laughs> there it goes. Ah, well. So we have a train roller coaster and then an actual train. Although, if you've been to a theme park, you know these aren't actual trains. It's a little tiny... It's a little tiny engine sitting on a cart. Um... Let's make the engine red. And the cars that follow can be... Anyway, well, we have a train... And it looks like it is... Well, now it's open. Very nice stats, though. Let's see, we got... What did we just learn? Oh, the suspended swinging coaster, fun. We'll have to build those over the mountains. Let's build some scenery! Oh, yes. First of all, let's orientate all this. Let's see, I need to work around this hole in the ground. 
And let's put some Sphinx. Sphinx is here. Now how about that? Apparently, if you look at a picture of an actual Sphinx, the head is undersized compared to the rest of the body. So, a lot of people suspect that the Sphinxes were actually just like maybe lions or something, but then someone came and changed them later to have a pharaoh's head on it. Which is why the head is smaller than everything, because they had to carve it or chisel it down. Anyway. So that's that, and I think we can turn our loan the rest of the way down. Oh, no, not quite. I'm going to leave this as a default price. I don't think it's going to make much. How cute. Okay, then. Ba, 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 ba. I just remembered, when you build more of one, more than one of the same kind of ride, people aren't as willing to pay as much for it. So, that means that... Well, first of all, I need to turn this off, and uh, I don't know if people are going to walk in here just for the sake of walking in here. Let's move this to the back end so I can extend this path here. There we go. I wanted to connect, I wanted to connect to the main path because people aren't going to go in here just to get to the entrance, I don't think. Or they might, but... Or they might not. Anybody? Any takers? Okay. 150 seems to be the good price for that, so let's do that to this one, which has no one in line at all. Except for a handyman. Why are there handymen in both of them? What are you guys doing? <laughs> okay, then. And I don't think anyone is riding this either. Is there anyone on the ride? Oh, no, there are people on the ride. Never mind. We're good. Okay, let's put some trees around our log flume. How much money is this making, by the way? Oh, wow. I think I found where most of our money's coming from. Woo! And I need to turn this down, because we're having a backup here. Losing potential money, I think, through that. This is fun, I like this. As I said, I have never played Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 until the other day when I published the previous scenario, Forest Frontiers, so that you could say this is the second time I have ever played Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. Is it called Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 or just Roller Coaster Tycoon? I'm not sure. I guess the game title is just Roller Coaster Tycoon, but because there's two of them, I'm just gonna call, them roller call it Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. Okay, so we have a variety of palm trees. We don't have more cactuses, though. Let's put some cactuses. Although, do cactuses grow in... around uh, Egypt? I'm not actually sure if they do. Let's just build them anyway. And cact cactuses are, funny enough, are directional. <laughs> Let's build them facing the other way. All right. What has been our latest research project? Still that roller coaster. Now we're studying mind theming. That's nice. Okay. And we get that when? The 2nd of April? So just a few days till we get that. So because of that, we can rest assured that I can build a suspended swinging coaster and that will be all of the rides in the game built. Or not in the game, all the rides available to us built. But I am running out of room, though. I don't know if I'm going to get a lot of more, a lot more flat rides, but eh, I'll build over here. Why not? Uh, whoops. Uh-oh, I'm going to crash into my Sphinx if I do that. Um, let's go the other way. And crash into the mine train instead. <laughs> Silly me. One trip, what? One train, still one train. Oh my goodness, these are long. Okay, let's not build there. Let's build it over here in this big open space we haven't used. 
I know we, this is flat space we could use for flat rides, but I mean, I've built multiple of most of the flat rides available anyway, so let's put it right here. Bada bing, bada boom. One train, still one train, still one train, my goodness. There we go, two trains. And because of how long this is, I feel comfortable doing that. <laughs> There's the mind theming. So we went from 80 to 60. That should be okay. And now we're out of money. So let's take a loan again. From 60 to 50. For people who have been wondering how they can improve the roller coasters, that's basically all it really is. Is well, not all the. What am I saying? One of the big tips, I guess I should say, to building a roller coaster is you build progressively lower and lower, and you kind of get a feel for it. Some roller coasters, especially with longer trains, they're better about conserving their momentum, as opposed to like wild mouse roller coasters. But like, look, I go from 80 feet up to 60 to 60 again, and I know I have a 20 foot difference from this from this uh, high point to this high point, that I should have enough momentum to make it through there. See, just like that. And now we're up to 50 feet. So, yeah. Oops, I went too far, too tall. Too tall, don't wanna do that. Uh-oh. Oh look, I just ducked run it right under my train. I wonder if I can helix the other way. Down left? Nope, I can't. I can go up, though? Huh. Uh, that's weird, but I'm going to do this instead. Where am I? Aha! Here we go. Can I sneak in here? Aw, oh, man, I can't. Okay, fine. I thought that would be cool if I could go through there. But can I go through here, though? I wonder if I can go over this. Ah, oh, dang it, I can't. <laughs> I should've known. Should've known that wouldn't work. Maybe like this, though. Uh, no. Okay, yeah, that's not going to work. Let's just bring this back to the station. Don't want to be too big. I mean, the amount of space we have to work with doesn't justify making a huge park anyway. Or a huge rides. Not park. What am I saying? I kind of like these smaller parks, though. Alright, and with this, we don't have photo sections, which is unfortunate, but we do have brakes. So let's slow ourselves down a tad. Now, let's make these 13, actually. I don't want any collisions, especially because of how long these are. And with that, the roller coaster is done. How fast can these go? Alright, not bad. All of my lift hills are the, not lift, all of my paths are the same color. So let's be different. Uh oh, I can't go in there. Can't do that either, it seems. Okay then, let us go under the station. Let's watch our lateral g-forces. That was big. And so was that. We went into the red. Only briefly, though. That's kind of the problem with this ride, is you don't have access to banked turns. Because you swing. So it's, that's part of the... That's by design. 
but it seems like it does less to uh, alleviate the g-forces than a, a traditional rolled turn would, so it's kind of problematic. Let's see. Ah, oh, we still survived. Oh, look at that nausea rating. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is a vomit machine and a half. With those stats, though, I think we can charge $15. Boom! Any takers? Oh, yeah, we got someone. And I think we need benches. A lot of benches. Let's actually change this. So we have a bench right out of the station. I did that wrong. <laughs> oh, look at our poor engineer. He's lost. <laughs> Sorry, I'll get you in a minute. There we go. Now I can put the bench right here in the exit. Oh, he found his own way. That's good. Oh, look at this guy. It's like, whoa. That's insane. I wonder if this Easter egg is part of Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. Hello, Chris Sawyer. Although, I guess I won't really know, because if he does start acting, if he does do it, the... So there's an Easter egg. If you name one of your guests, Chris Sawyer, in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, they stop and take pictures of stuff. Okay, not like that. He's checking his pockets. <laughs> but they stop and take pictures of stuff. And I think they also perform differently on the go-kart strike. Yep, yep, right there. He's, just, he's taking pictures. So that's an Easter egg, but I don't know if that's part of Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 or part of Open RCT 2. Because normally that's a that's an Easter egg in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, and this is Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. That didn't make a lot of sense, did it? Uh, what I'm saying is, Roller Co uh, Open RCT 2 gives uh, you access to a lot of features that are unique to Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, because you're basically playing Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 scenarios in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 because of the mod Open RCT 2. Oh, that did not sound good. Making the merry-go-round music clash. <laughs> Let's keep this all in one area. Oh, look at everyone. Coming in droves. Come on down, my friends. Come and witness the joy that is Dynamite Dunes. Let's start another ad campaign and... Advertise a new roller coaster. And I think we need a new fleet of handymen because we're going to have a lot of vomit now. With a, with a, a nausea rating that's almost 10... I really, what was it, 9.6? Sheesh! <laughs> That's insane. Twist one has broken down. That's not good. No one is riding this. Is this too expensive? Oh, yeah. I noticed it was too expensive and I didn't fix it. Silly me. There we go. Fixed it. What else is too expensive? The car ride. No one is riding it. Is 50 cents too expensive? How about 20 cents? Come on, people, please! Not paying 50 cents to ride it. <laughs> well, now we have someone. I think this is just, this ride is just going to be at a loss the whole time. No profit for us. Oh, it's terrible. Let's see if we can maybe boost the excitement with some vegetation. <laughs> no! Oh, we got fountains. Fun. Let's just sporadically place them everywhere around our water ride. I haven't been paying much attention to our science research. Oh, we have a chairlift. I wonder if we can put that somewhere. What else do we have access to that I haven't been paying attention to? Oh, no, that's it. Yeah, we have everything in the park, or everything unlocked except for the chairlift, so let's build a chairlift. And maybe bring it up to here. This is a funky place to put it, isn't it? Oh, goodness. No, that's, that's not going to work. Uh, yeah, it's not going to work at all. Okay, we'll put that there. Put that there. All right. And uh, have a blue path, just to be different. Which is not where I normally place it. 
There we go. Okay. And this will go line up with this spot. Oh, we're way past it. Dang it. Um, I don't know if I'm lined up. Why am I going up, though? <laughs> Silly me. This doesn't need to go up. Let's just go straight. Oh, we almost lined up perfectly. Dang it. Just one more piece. Go up one more time. There we go. Now we're lined up with the edge of the park. And we are 85 feet up, so let's start coming down here. I came down too soon. I crashed into the spiral slide. No! How about now? There we go. Wonderful. Hold on, let's go straight first. Turn. Now station platform. Oh, I just uh, just did the exact same thing. Never mind, I'm leaving it like this. This is fine. This is fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Why can't I place it? What's happening? There we go. That was weird. I was like, I, it wouldn't let me place the, the exit. The entrance. What am I saying? All right. How many chair, how many chairs we get? Okay, that's the maximum. Let's turn this all the way up to the maximum as well and fire away. Turn that off. Actually, no. Leave it on, but let's turn this down to I don't know, 3 seconds. Chairlift cars, that's the default. Okay. Your advertising campaign for the park has finished. Let's restart it. Wonder how much can, can we maximize it? Oh, we can. Look at that. And now I can't afford the other one. <laughs> Silly me. Is anything too expensive to ride? Oops. Don't open that. Uh, the spiral slide. No one is riding it. Is that because it's too spendy? We can't afford it. Do I have cash machines? I still don't. Okay. Uh, well, no one's riding it. I don't know if that's because it's too expensive or just because people want to go on something more exciting. Oh, someone's riding it. A frowning... Uh, no, I, I could click on him. Someone who has hands in his pockets. He looks sad. Okay, so that seems to be fine. It's just not a lot of people want to ride it. What about this one? Not paying that much, he says. Okay, let's change this back to the default of one dollar. Great. Is that this one? Oh, that was the first one. Wow, what a park! This is coming together great. Although, I do want to change the color of this. Let's make the... Let's make the track here. Ooh, that's fun. A brilliant blue. And the supports can be yellow. I actually don't like that at all. Let's make it red. Okay. That's good. And this seems to have broken down. Oh no, it just got fixed. Never mind. This, I called it coconutter, but I never really painted it. I wonder... I wonder if I make this purple... and yellow... Uh, maybe. Okay. Okay. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> we'll we'll do that. Fun. And we still have the default train coaster that we started with. Still making bank for us. That's good. It's made a total of sixteen thousand for us. What about this one? What's the twenty-four thousand? Not bad. What about this one? <laughs> Five thousand. It's hard to squat. Are people not riding it? Oh, they're riding it. There's just not a lot of people on it. How about this? Still a big-time moneymaker. And this one is starting to recover its uh, money-making power. I want to go home, he says. Oh, 
Oh yeah, he has no money left. And he's hungry. Well, I think we need to have more food stalls. Oh yeah, we just unlocked fries. I forgot. We unlocked fries. So let's put that right there. And charge two dollars. Two dollars for fries, people. And do we have any other drinks available? Nah, just these ones. Alright, put those here. Same price as that park. Okay. And this just broke down. Didn't it? Oh no, it's still testing. I never opened it. Heh <laughs> Silly me. Let's leave this price at the default. But <laughs> oh, I love it when it does this. Oh, oh, I just remembered. Roller Coaster Tycoon 1? Is Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 the game where it explodes, or is that some someone's mod? I'm not sure. <laughs> I hope it explodes. That'll be so funny. <laughs> Come on. Go boom. I don't know if it's going to do it. We're just going to let that go in the background for a while and just see what happens. That's hilarious. Oh, I love it when that happens. What are we studying? We just got the fry shop. We are studying a thrill ride by the 28th of June. We're halfway through year two. What the heck? We have squashed the scenario already and we have all this time left. I guess, as I said, we are just beautifying the park at this point. Oh, go-karts! Woohoo! Beautifying indeed. That'll be fun. Okay. Well, that's uh, in five days. Four days. June 24th. Where would I even put go-karts, though? Oh, I remember, we can buy land. Yeah, I forgot, we can buy land. Let's expand our park. Let's make our park, oh dang it, nah, I didn't need to do that. Let's make our park bigger. How much does this cost? Oh, that's spendy, my goodness. Let's just buy whole swaths of land. Woo, goodbye money. <laughs> oh, we destroyed our account. <laughs> I wonder if we can buy all of this before the end of year three. That's a lot, though. Anyway, uh, we'll leave it like that for now and build ourselves some go-karts. Okay, these appear to be the pre-builds from the basic game. Castle carts, I'm pretty sure that's from Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. Why am I getting Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 builds and Roller Coaster Tycoon 1? Was it originally a Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 build that was carried over to Roller Coaster Tycoon 2? I don't know. Maybe it's because of Roller Coaster uh, Open RCT2. But I'm assuming these are from the expansions, like Corkscrew Follies and the other one. Listen to that merry-go-round. <laughs> it's out of control. <laughs> of course it hasn't been fixed. That's by design. I don't want to fix it. No path leading from this exit. Again, by design. Alright. Now, how much can we charge for this? Let's charge $6. I don't know if that's going to work, though. And set this to two laps. I don't want it to be too long, because I built a long track. <laughs> well, I'm going to assume that this is never going to explode, so I guess we'll, uh, we'll grant our engineer access to fix it. But where is he, though? Oh, he's a little far away. Come here, buddy. Here you go. You go ahead and fix that for us. All right, well... Our go-karts are making money, it seems. That's good. Oh, what are they wearing? That's not in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. That must be unique to Roller Coaster Tycoon 1. They're all wearing helmets. That's cool. I don't remember if they wear... Well, I don't remember if they wear helmets in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, but if they do, it's a different color. Huh. Anyway. What else do we have available to us? Okay, we're, we're researching a gentle ride. 
Let's see when we get access to that. Uh, 20, 20th of July. Oh, bumper cars! That'll be a nice addition to our park. Okay, let's offer free... <laughs> free entry to the park. <laughs> you don't have to pay entry to the park anyway. I wonder how many guests we'll generate with those. Just a little exploit. <laughs> let's get free rides on the Ferris wheel. Get you in the door so you can pay for the other rides. And free... free fries! Wow, we made most of our money back already. With that, we could probably buy more land. I'm gonna leave this sped up. Let's see, how much does that cost? Okay, I can't read when it does that. $360. Sheesh. Yeah, that's expensive. Oh, our campaign's finished already because I was speeding it up. Let's restart the... Oh, uh, no, there. Never mind. That was a different one. Our park is getting rather crowded. I think we need to expand into all the land we just bought. So let's... Uh, well, first of all, what do we uh, have eventual access to? Okay, well, for all this, mountains, the mountains aren't very useful, so let's buy all this stuff first, and then maybe connect it in the middle here. Ooh, balloons! Let's buy balloons. Pop. And we will charge 120 for those, and make these red. Bold, bright colors for balloons. Another one right here. And make these ones yellow. The color of happiness. I think I say that every single playthrough I do, I call it the color of happiness. <laughs> I need something more original to say. Let's make these ones green and purple. Okay, I don't like that shade. Let's make it a little darker. And over here, let's go for... We didn't do blue yet, so let's make these blue. We'll leave it at the default. Bright blue. Okay, all of our advertising campaigns just wrapped up. Although, since this, this park is pay-per-ride versus pay-per-entry, we're not making a lot of money from our ad campaigns. Oh, look how many people are coming in. Woo! Let's offer free rides on the chairlift for 12 weeks. And free burgers for 12 weeks. Bop, 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 bop. And the wind roller coaster campaign is about to finish. Uh oh. Where is the engineer responsible for this? Oh, he's there. Oops, I think I sped up by mistake. <laughs> well, he's fixing it, so that's alright. Uh, do we have this yet? No, uh, we still don't have it. There we go! Let's advertise that uh, swinging roller coaster for 12 weeks. Boom! Goodbye, money. And let's buy more land. Starting, of course, with the flat stuff over here, because this is the useful stuff. That's all I can do. <laughs> We're out of money. <laughs> do we have any more flat rides that I missed? No. Oh, we got the bumper cars. I completely missed that. Where do I want to put it, though? <laughs> we can just tuck it right in there. <laughs> Hold on. Let me, let me see. So this goes all the way out here, so let's plan out our path network. So we could probably build another loop. Or no, we could... No, let's just fill this area with rides. I think I'm going to leave the paths alone. We'll leave the paths alone until we get here. Maybe we can loop 
the path around the back here. Go over this dune and maybe connect here or connect over here. I don't know. Oh, look, we have money again. Let's buy more land. No. There we go. <laughs> Now we have a peninsula of land sticking out into into nowhere. Okay, let's speed things up and see how much money we make. How quickly we make it. How much money are we making per month, by the way? We have a steady income of just shy of 10,000 by the looks of it. And because it rained, we sold a ton of umbrellas, which is why we have 3,000 there. Okay, so we made less than 9,000 that year, that month. What am I saying? So, that's not good. Uh, that might have been because this was broken down for much of the month. I think. Unless that was the previous month, I don't know. But we're making our money back very, very fast, so let's build these bumper cars. Somewhere. Ah, whatever, we'll just tuck it back here. We'll put, we'll put scenery in that space we have. I could have laid this out a lot better. What I could do is wrap this around like so, because the, where is it? The, the no, not that. The land that we have access to, <laughs> dang it, delete that. Goes all the way out here. I don't know, my path layout doesn't make sense. That's what happens when you freehand it. Can I charge $2 for this? Can pay two hundred two dollars. What about two fifty? Looks like the people in line are impatient. They're like, we've been in this line for ages. Oh yeah, seven minutes. That is kind of a long time. But in real life, it's I feel like forty-five minutes in line is kind of normal in some parks, especially smaller parks that have way too many people in them. My goodness. Well, 250 seems to be okay. Oh, wow. Woo! We have 27,000. Okay, let's buy more land. And watch as our money just disappears. It just evaporates into thin air. And now, we're broke. <laughs> Oh no, it looks like some of our ad campaigns just finished. Yeah, most of them finished. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, so we have some funky loops over here. I guess they're not much... They're <sighs> These are smaller loops too, so I guess it's fine that we have some small loops path loops looped path I don't know what to call that uh what do we have access to oh oh we have a top spin or no it's in development but we do have cotton candy now fun let's sell this for 120 and it looks like our oh yeah our mechanics are completely overworked so let's hire more of those guys I never changed the color of the cars on this. Silly me, I don't like these colors. Let's go with, uh... Maybe yellow? Or no, let's do something different. Uh, Pink? Yeah, that's fun. Pink and purple, we got bruise colors. There we go, now we have a top spin. Let's grab that and put it uh, put it right here, I think. 
Or no, let's put it here. I keep trying to cram into these. I see a space where it fits perfectly and my brain goes Tetris mode. I'm like, oh, we gotta put it right there. <laughs> we don't have to put it there. I just do for some reason. Let's put this right here. Oh, whoops, wait, wait, wait. Berserk mode. I thought I closed it. Give me berserk mode. There we go. Okay, and how much can we charge for this? Crazy ride with crazy stats. Oh, lag. Lag spike. No. Okay, we're good. We're good. We survived. Four dollars, really? Wow. Okay. Oh, with stats like that, that makes sense. Let's charge more. <laughs> I wonder if we can charge six. Will people pay? Si oh, they will. Look at that. Except for the people who didn't have enough money in their pocket. We really need an ATM. Oh, we have a dinghy slide. Okay, we have two versions of dinghy drop. I wonder... Let me build this right in here. sneak in here. Oh no, I can't. Okay. Okay, we'll switch back to regular. Actually, let's do it. go down a little more. Oh, can't do that. Woo! Oh, I keep... I keep clicking on it thinking it'll toggle off. I have to click the other one. the edge of the park over here? Oh, no, I'm not. I'm just, uh... Oh! That's fun! And somewhat cursed. <laughs> it goes right through it! That's not natural at all. Okay, we went from 30 to... I don't know if we're gonna have enough momentum because these slow down so fast. Alright, let's see what happens. Can I change the lift hill on these? Oh, I can. Look at that. Okay, it's going to come out any second. Oh, that's pathetic. It hardly even... Alright, I guess we'll just do this. And with that, this is done. I'm pretty sure it's going to be perfectly safe. Oh no, I didn't think that through. If there's a minimum drop height requirement, I possibly missed it, but it's a pretty smallish ride. I think we're okay. Uh, what else have we researched? Oh, we're getting a new roller coaster. Yes! We could probably fill all the space we purchased with it. Okay, where's, where's car number one? Boat one, I should say. Does anyone know why this ride is categorized as a water ride when there's no water in it? I mean, I've been on water rides that look a lot like this, but I don't see water in it. Unless that's just an issue of uh, the uh, how it was designed to look, but in reality, it's based on a real-life ride that has water in it. I don't even know. Those stats are terrible. Let's open this up. <laughs> Maybe for $3. Will people pay $3 for these sad stats? What are these colors, though? Ooh. Ooh! Okay, I don't like that. That's fun. Red, white, and blue. Okay, I like these colors, but it's too, uh, the proximity is too close to our other ride that has the same colors. So instead, let's make this 
yellow and green. Uh, not green. Yellow and purple? That's fun. But now the boats are... Oh, for crying out loud. Let's make the boats blue. Uh, not blue. Let's make the boats... Hey, that's good. All right. Well, people are writing it. That's a good sign. And I need to restart my ad campaigns. Just briefly. Dingy Slide 1. That's such a funny name. Dingy Slide. That's a good sight. A, a full queue line. That means we have a ton of people in the park. Uh-oh. What happened here? Safety cut out. That's not good. And no one is riding it. No recent thoughts. I have a feeling that's because... Okay, they can't afford it. What are you doing in there? Get to the exit. Actually, where where is your mechanic? Oh, it's this guy. Please don't go in there. Please don't go in there. Oh, good. He walked past it. Why did he walk past it? What are you doing? Hold up. Are all of these guys busy? Oh, no. Never mind. It's fixed. Well, <laughs> never mind. What, what was I thinking? Okay. Thoughts, please. Not paying that much. I was afraid of that. Okay. Let's change this to $8. Not $8. Oh, no. $8. Will people pay that? Oh my goodness, look at this roller coaster and these crazy drops. Woohoo! Oh good, people are getting back in line. That's good. Do we have any other rides that have expired? This one seems to have expired. Let's change this to $10. What else? The haunted house? Oh, it was just reloading. Okay. merry go round one. Nobody's riding it. Is it just too expensive? Not paying that much. It's the default price. Meh. Yeah, that's lame. Okay, well, we have a increase in cash. Oh, yeah, look, we have a solid income of about 10000 per month. Very nice. Now, I think we have a new roller coaster now. Aha! A stand-up roller coaster. I don't really like those much. Rocket cars? Uh, all right. Oh, okay. I see. So we do have this in the in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, I think. It's just a different style of trains. Or maybe... Yeah, I don't know. It's not the same. Let's build a stand-up roller coaster, and I need to see what I'm working with here. I, let's connect this land first. I don't want to work like that. Um, and watch as our money just evaporates. Let's turn a loan up. Just so we can buy the rest of this. And that's it. We're out of money. <laughs> We're out of money and our loan is maxima uh, maximized. <laughs> I guess we just have to earn our way back. And we have a few months to do it. We have this empty spot I haven't used. What was I thinking? I wonder if I can put anything else in here. Oh, this is too close to everything. I don't want to put that there. If we get a 2x2... Two two... Actually, we have one. We have this. Those are some fun colors. Will people pay one dollar for the spiral slide? Nope. Okay, they want to go on something more thrilling, they say. Come on, any takers? I need to know if it's because it's too expensive or if you just don't like this. Oh, there's someone. Okay, good. Very nice. I think we need more colors of balloons. So let's buy more balloon stalls. And make these ones pink. And 
these ones, which we will place over here, those ones can be dark blue since we have a light blue already. Okay, what is this roller coaster we're researching? Ooh, a corkscrew roller coaster. Aha. I might want to build that instead of the stand up roller coaster just because I like them better. But we are running out of time. We're halfway through year three. And we're starting to pay. We're starting to get money back so we can try to pay our loan off. I think we will have the option of either being able to pay our loan off or buy the rest of the land, but not both. I don't know. Let's see what happens. But I have a feeling that without a cash machine, our income is going to be very limited. Yeah, we had a couple months of 11,000. Now we're just around 9,000 per month. Okay, I checked that. 10,000? I don't know. <laughs> Look at that. We spent 20,000 in one month <laughs> buying land. Wow. Sheesh. All right, well, we're in July now, so... Oh, happy, happy birthday, America. Just passed July 4th. Well, that was quick. Look how fast we're making money. Woo! Okay, now the loan's paid off. So I vote, instead of buying the rest of the land, we get money and build a roller coaster before the scenario finishes, because I'd like to have a corkscrew roller coaster. And we're earning that money back very quickly. That's good to see. Where is it? Here we go. So we have our corkscrew roller coaster. Let's build that up here. And how many trains do we get? That does not look like the, the corkscrew roller coaster in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. That's neat. It's, it's got softer edges. The one in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 has very sharp edges. This is cool. I like this. Okay, then. Let's come flying out of the station. And these boosters look different, too. Oh, that was pathetic. Let's do this instead. We do have helixes, that's good to see. Uh, well that didn't do what I was hoping it would. Uh oh. Okay, let's go half loop. How tall are we, 80 feet? This might be a bit rough, but I want to try it. Just Let's just see what happens. Yeah, that's a bit hot going through there, but I think we can handle it. We're tough. We are strong. And we can... We ran out of money. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, let's head back to the station. We do make it over the hill, though. Okay, these hills are really funky. Look how look at the shape. They have an abrupt change in a in slope and then a gradual change in slope. I'm just experimenting honestly, but Yeah, I don't like the way that looks, so let's not do that. Let's bring this back and that goes to 65. Dang it. I want it to flatten out level right there, but it does it doesn't look like I'm going to be allowed to do that. So instead, we'll just do this. Oh, here we go. Let's get a photo section. Oh, we 
have souvenir style. Nice. Not that we can do much with it. All right, time for breaks. Let's bring this down to a modest 18. And as I was afraid, we are not able to do that. Okay. Um, oh, we're not even level with the station. Okay, let's uh, put brakes here to 18. Bring this down to 13. Oops. Brakes to 13. Very nice. All right. Okay, then. Well, we have two trains. What are the default? Oh, straight red. I'm not sure I like that. It looks like a toy car. <laughs> Here's a fun color. Okay. Follow a main view. Woo! Let's watch these laterals. Eh, not bad at all. Very good. Now for the sketchy part. Oh, goodness. That was over 5 G's. <laughs> wow. That was rough. Nothing in red, though, so I think we'll be okay. Oops, didn't mean to close that. I think we're okay, so let's see what the test results are. Oh, we didn't, we didn't pass 6 in the excitement. Oh, that's a bummer. That's an ugly bummer. Oh, well. Let's change the style for these to be something... I mean... Everyone knows that the pyramids were really built by the aliens. <laughs> Just kidding. They were actually built by Elon Musk in another life. He's a reincarnation of the original, the original build. I'm going to stop now. <laughs> what am I on about? Okay, then. Well, I think we can charge, I don't know, $12 for these. I mean, look at the stats. It's not even that good. Uh... Open up. We're at the end of August. Okay, let's paint this something spectacular. Something bold. Black and red. White and red. No, let's do black and red. And the trains. I think I'm going to leave the trains. Let's build those darn souvenirs and change the price of these cuddly toys to 450 I think we can charge 450 for them. He's broke. Heh <laughs> heh. Okay, well, we've already squashed the objective. We have nearly twice as many guests as required to win. Um, what are we studying? Oh, another thrill ride. When do we get? The 15th of sub September? Okay. Okay, this is making money. That's a good sign. Is there anything I missed? Any new things that I wasn't paying attention to? Okay, let's group rides of the same type. There we go. I thought we had more more car rides, but they're all the same ride. So group them together. That's another cool thing in Open RCT2, is I don't think you could do that in the original games. Oh, we have a monorail. Not that we need it. Well, we're making all kinds of money, so I say, why don't we buy more land? Now nah, let's not buy land. Let's build more stuff. More stuff! Let's build another pirate ship. Maybe one right in here. And I suspect the one we built before probably, probably has nobody on it because it's probably expired and it's a uh, useful life. So let's open this, maybe set it to, I don't know, three dollars. Where's the first one we built? I lost track of it. I don't remember where I put it. Oh, it's right here. As I suspected, there's nobody on it. Let's change this to three dollars. Will anyone pay three dollars? I actually doubt they'll pay that because it's old. Let's bring this back to the default of 1.5. But we only have a lot of vegetation by the entrance. I want to have more vegetation. Let's build some more palm trees. Oh, 
I don't know why I really like these tall ones. Oh, the swinging inverter ship. That's a good one. Okay, we'll have to build that in a minute. But first, let's finish populating our park with some lovely trees. Let's get some shorter ones. Let's just make this more rapid fire. Woo! Okay. And now, let's build our new ride, the Swinging Inverter Ship. And these we can charge a lot for because of their insane stats. Well, insane for a flat ride, at least. Six dollars. Now let's flesh out this area, maybe with another go-kart ride. Ah, I just planted that. Oh well. <laughs> I guess that's it for that palm tree. Oval circuit. Not much to see. Now I think we unlocked mine theming and I never built anything from it. So let's populate some of our open areas with this stuff. Oh, like right here. Can we build it anywhere in here? Ah, oh, not have room anywhere. That's too bad. Okay, we're almost to the end of September, almost into October, so we are approaching the end of our scenario. And I think we've done really well. Look at this place. We've made a bustling theme park with over 1,000 guests. I mean, that's not a lot, honestly, but we didn't have a lot of space to work with, and I spent all my money buying land. Oh, wow. Yeah, our, our park and company value haven't changed a lot. I probably could have made it a lot bigger if I, instead of doing that, built more rides on top of each other, but that wouldn't have looked very good, so... Do we get any more cool stuff before the scenario's over? It doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's build more flat rides over here, because we can. Actually, we can't. Oh, I'll build it in here. Here we go. Leave that at the default price. No one is riding this. Oh, there's one person in line. Oops. There's one person in line. I guess someone's riding it. Two dollars. What the? I just opened it. <laughs> it broke down right as I opened it. What the heck? Okay then. Well, we'll leave that alone. That's annoying. Yeah, uh, anyway, now we're in October, so we're uh, towards the end. Do we know what kind of roller coaster that is yet? We get it? Oh, we get it halfway through the month. That's not, that's not even going to finish in time. Okay, let's just turn this off. We don't need it anymore. Save money! And I think, yep, I paid off my loan, and I have a surplus of cash. That's good to see. And all of this extra space we purchased and didn't use... <laughs> Of course we didn't use it. I wonder if we can build one more small ride before the scenario's over. Maybe one of these. Oh, this fits in our theme. Mummy's Curse. No, that's too big. Okay, that, <laughs> that merry-go-round music clashes terribly. We have less than a month to build a roller coaster, but I think we can do it. It's not going to be very big. So let's uh, get our brakes on here. All right. Oh, that's only one train. 
Okay, one train is fine. It doesn't have to be very big. From 55 to 45, that should be fine. Uh-oh, that's not going to work. Let's flatten out right here. And we have half loops on this, don't we? Ah, uh, no, we don't. We do have loops, though. So let's loop right. I have a feeling we're not going to have enough speed to make it through that loop. Let's see what happens here. Woohoo! Yeah, not even close. <laughs> okay. We're building this taller. Uh, not much taller by the look of it. We're right up against our woody. I do have space to do this, though, by the look of things. All right, now we can loop right there. And maybe, ooh, this will be cool. Corkscrew left twice. Uh, we, we're not gonna be able to do that though. <laughs> yeah, we have 10 days left in the scenario. Let's wrap it up and come back to the station. Uh, how, though? How do we do that? Um, oh, let's go through the loop on the way back. Uh, can't do that. Yeah, it looks like my lift is in the way. I'm not going to be able to go through it, I don't think. Maybe. I'm curious. Can I... No. Could I potentially go through the loop if I was lined up properly? Oh, I could. Look at that. I just have to line up properly. Okay. But the lift is still in the way. Never mind. We have seven days to finish. Okay, let's not do that. Uh... Okay, I have five days left. Sheesh! Okay, okay, okay. Let's sort of come back to the station somehow. Oh no, the mine train's in the way. And I'm not lined up. Darn it. Okay, okay. Reevaluate, reevaluate. Uh. Here we go. Okay, can't do that. Come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Here we go. Okay, let's put brakes to 18 right here. We have an oversized roller coaster for one train. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. I don't think we're going to be able to test it. Oh, yeah, the scenario's over. It's the 31st already. Yeah, game over. This is it. Woo! Okay, well, despite not finishing our new roller coaster, that was very fun. Anyway, <laughs> that's too bad. But wow, look at all those balloons. Oh my goodness. Isn't that spectacular? 
Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe so you know when the next one comes out. There is a lot more Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 scenarios I have to play through, and it's going to be a good time. So be sure to tune in so you know when they get released, and I will see you in the next video. Have a great rest of your day, and goodbye.